Male red start and black red start are easy to tell apart on their breeding grounds. But females and young birds are very similar and these can often cause confusion. The most distinctive feature of both of these species is the eponymous red tail, which is clearly visible in all ages, plumages and throughout the year. Having realised that you are looking at a red start, you then have to determine which of the two species it is. Clues that will help you do this include plumage, habitat, behaviour and song. Red start is a relatively common summer visitor to the UK, being found in mature deciduous woodland, scrub and even hedges principally in the north and west during the breeding season. There are over 100,000 pairs of red start, although the species is very rare in Ireland. Red start are generally only found in the summer, but individuals can turn up on migration in unexpected places such as gardens and urban areas, but the birds are rarely found far from vegetation. Spring males are stunning birds, with a black throat, white forehead, grey back and rufous breast, all of which are highly distinctive. In the autumn, however, in fresh plumage, these colour patches are masked by buff feather fringes, but a shadow of the male's pattern is still visible. The song consists of short, sweet phrases, usually starting with a shri, followed by a short, warbled phrase, before usually tailing quickly off. Males often sing from the very tops of trees, moving around their territories from tree to tree. Very young birds are spotted like baby robins, but differ in already sporting the red tail. Females and first winter birds, however, are less distinctive and can appear similar to female and young black red starts. Red starts are a warm buff brown, paler underneath, with a prominent pale eye ring, making the eye appear relatively large in the head. There is also a paler throat. The birds prefer to perch in trees and shrubs quivering their tails, but will drop to the ground to feed. There they hop about with a very robin-like jizz. The call is a nondescript huit call, similar to a willow warbler, but sometimes finished with a very robin-like tick. Huit tick, huit tick tick. The huit call can also be repeated incessantly. Black red starts are birds of rocks and mountains, but have learnt to live in towns and cities where buildings have taken the place of the natural outcrops. They are rare in the UK, with about 50 breeding pairs, mainly in London, but odd pairs occur elsewhere in the country. During winter it's more likely to find black red starts on coastal cliffs and beaches. And, like red start, black red starts can crop up anywhere on passage. I have seen a female black red start on a front lawn in spring. Males are striking and distinctive, with an overall black appearance, red tail and usually a white panel on the wings. The most obvious difference at a glance is the lack of white forehead, black chest and white wing patch. The song is unique, consisting of a series of fairly unassuming sweet warbles interspersed with a very strange crackle which has been likened to crunching gravel, crackling plastic wrappers, or even electricity. Once heard, it's never forgotten. Often habitat and location will help if a female or younger bird is encountered, but if a bird is seen out of context, then we need to look closer. Very young black red starts are not spotted, and so they all look much like the adult female. Apart from the red tail, the birds are overall grey-brown darker than red start and without the lighter throat and belly. Even the dullest female red starts are not as plain or greyish as black red start. The eye ring is very thin and the dark eye can almost become lost in the face. Black red start are often found comfortably away from vegetation, perching on rocks or buildings, but they also drop to the ground to feed. But here they run between hops, something red start don't do. Call may help you. Attack sound, stony like the environment they live in, often repeated, tack, 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 like pebbles being tapped together. <laughs>